Understanding Shade Tolerant, a guide for English learners. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase, shade tolerant. This term is often used in gardening and botany, but it also has broader meanings in different contexts. Let's dive in and understand what shade tolerant really means. Shade tolerant is a term used primarily in botany and gardening. It describes plants that can survive and thrive in low light conditions, typically under the canopy of larger plants or trees. The phrase combines two words, shade, meaning an area of darkness caused by something blocking the direct light, and tolerant, which means being able to endure specific conditions without adverse effects. Many plants are shade tolerant, meaning they can grow in areas with limited sunlight. For instance, ferns and mosses found in forest undergrowth are great examples. These plants have adapted to low light environments and can photosynthesize efficiently under these conditions. Understanding this concept helps in gardening, especially when deciding where to plant certain types of vegetation. Beyond botany, shade tolerant can be used metaphorically. In a broader context, it might describe a person or an organization that can operate effectively in less than ideal circumstances. For example, a business thriving in a competitive market could be described as shade tolerant. In practical terms, knowing which plants are shade tolerant is crucial for garden planning. It's also helpful in understanding ecosystems and how different plants coexist. Additionally, the metaphorical use of shade tolerant can enrich our understanding of resilience and adaptability in various aspects of life. So, that's shade tolerant for you. Whether you're talking about plants thriving in the shadows or people and organizations adapting to challenging environments, being shade tolerant is all about resilience and adaptability. We hope this video has shed light on this interesting phrase. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.